What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to a brand new video. So today we're going to be installing some 345 Hemi badges. As you can see, I've tried this in the past, but it wasn't lined up exactly. So went ahead on Amazon and purchased this. So as you can see, it's like completely lined up and it's going to look so much better than what I had on here originally. Now for the install, I know that everything's already knocked off. That's why it's kind of like gray right here, right? So I just took some fishing line. I'll throw a clip over this. Took some fishing line and just thread it out. Um, the original badges. Um, then what I'm actually going to do is take some of this stuff right here. This is another video. <laughs> That's why everything is spread out. But take some of this. It's called Gugon. You can purchase this at AutoZone, Walmart, wherever, right? And you're just going to come over here. And spray. Only bad things it drips down the car. So I'm going to have to wipe that off in a bit. But... So I'm gonna just spray, and that's gonna loosen up some of that enamel to allow for you to take it off. So I'll go ahead and scrape this off, and then we'll get the new badges installed pretty quickly. Say we always move so fast, huh? <laughs> <laughs> you, go. you gonna you gonna narrate later or what? Yeah. Okay. Too easy. Huh? <laughs> yeah. All right. So I actually have this little squeegee thing that I can use just to wedge in between there just careful not like pressing super hard because i don't want to you know take off any paint but as you can see it makes peeling it a whole lot easier so we're just going to go ahead and like i said if you just bought the hemi off the lot you're not going to have this three four five to worry about um you're just going to have the hemi part to worry about so just sprayed a little bit of glue gone on there just to loosen up the enamel like we said and now we're just wedging all this out so i'll go ahead and i'll get this taken off clean it so everything looks nice and fresh and i'll show you guys how i line it up perfectly for the install Oh my gosh, so like, and you can see bro, like the amount of dirt that gets like trapped in these little crevices of the original badges, it's crazy bro. So I made sure to wash the whole car before, you know, anytime I like do projects on it, but definitely gonna have to give this a little rinse down on this side just to make sure I have a clean surface when sticking the new adhesive to. And, you know, just make it sharing that we don't have any problems. Alrighty guys, so we run into a bit of a problem. I don't know if you can see, it's very minimal. It's one of those things that you'll only notice, but there's still a bit of dirt residue at the very top. And I was scrubbing like crazy with the bucket, wasn't able to get it off. So I'm gonna take a clay bar and then use the clay bar to um, basically go over this like so. And you see when the clay bar gets it right off. Now, if you're ever using clay bar, make sure that the area is pretty lubricated. So that's what we're doing here. And then just taking this and then just rubbing that outer edge. Like I said, I just want the whole surface to be clean to ensure everything sticks perfectly and doesn't look tacky. So, okay, so I just got everything leveled out and all of the measurements in place. So right now what I'm doing is I'm going through and peeling out the adhesive. And then with this leveler, basically, I compensated a little bit for the slope that the car is on but i'm gonna put it right here of course i'm gonna like i make sure everything looks right before I, I paste it but it's pretty much gonna be like this and that should be pretty even and um another trick that you guys can use too is this bolt right here the hemi badge should be just like right here corresponding so i just sort of use that as like my median i see some people put it like super high but if you use this bolt that's pretty much how the factory determines the level it's supposed to be at so okay so now we just got it on so what i'm gonna do is basically do a little cut like so so i can pull out the little 
uh -huh. corners, and then that didn't really cut, but it's all good. Basically, I'm just gonna pull out that outer edge of the thing. And if you looked on the last clip, you saw that I only peeled out the areas where like the three for five and the hemi were. So, you know, everything is so hard to do with one hand, but do as much as I can. Then I'll show you guys the finished product. Yo guys, what's going on? So it's actually the next day. Um, I wanted to go ahead and give you guys a look at the badges, right? So nice little sunset hour, you know, beautiful. Um, so this is how the badges turned out. Looks pretty good. And my opinion, a little bit dirty. So I'm gonna get a car wash pretty soon, but I'll focus. But as you can see, definitely makes your car come together a whole lot better, in my opinion. And I'm super excited with how it turned out, guys. Um, so that's probably going to wrap up this video. Um, if you have any questions on where I got anything from, just make sure you check the description. Anything else, feel free to either message me on here or send me a DM on Instagram and I'll get back to you guys. Without further ado, guys, I'm going to catch you in the next video. Peace.